I think when he told us we were beta testing, I, I thought I was super excited. You know, my class was lucky and got to get a sneak peek and got to provide feedback as part of the, the beta process of the Minecraft Education Edition, and that was exciting for them. They got to test out the new features and, and help even find bugs and report them to the team and see the, the things that they reported getting fixed in the game now that the official Education Edition has been released. I was really excited because um, beta testing something is always fun, even though there always is problems with every beta testing. I think with beta testing, the cool part about it is you can also provide feedback to like the uh, developer teams that are designing it. And I think that's really cool as well because now parts of it might actually be like suggestions that you created. You could enjoy them. They'd be related to what you said. Seeing even middle school students critiquing games, giving feedback, debugging their games is, is so great. And we love to see that and inspire that and bring them into our process. We want to have student voice in our development and in everything we're doing. For them to be part of a, you know, a launch of a commercial product that they're familiar with and be able to shape that process, I mean, you can't get more authentic than that. So for them to be able to participate, it's, you know, like I say, it's really modeling what I'm teaching in class. And they have the best insight for what they need in the game, so who better to ask and to get on finding bugs and things than kids. And I really like how they're taking the feedback of students because that allows us to have a voice. And Mr. Isaacs, our teacher, he really encourages student voice in our classes. So I think it's a really good idea. It's unique because it engages the students. Many of them are familiar with Minecraft uh, outside the classroom. And so to be able to bring that in and have a teacher act as a guide in that learning experience is really powerful.